Hey you guys, what is up? Budley Neck here. It's Easter evening. Um, I hope you guys had a, a fantastic Easter. I did. I uh, had a good day with my family, ate some good food, had the egg hunt, did the whole thing. Uh, I saw today on Mind Saga they were giving away uh, everybody that was logged in got an Easter uh, bunny boss egg. And when I saw they were doing that, I logged four of my alts on over here. You're allowed up to four alts that are doing nothing. Uh, if you go more than that, then they each have to have something to keep them busy. So say for instance, if you had eight cactus farms, you could have eight alts on each one loading a cactus farm. Uh, but if you don't have something for them to do, you're allowed four, up to four that uh, are just standing around to collect keys for you. So anyway, I logged those guys on and had them uh, on here all day. And I got, actually I had one more egg and I tried recording it earlier and it messed up. But I saw a lot of people having trouble beating this boss. And they were saying what a pain in the butt it was to beat it. So I made this and this works great, you guys. It's just a too deep hole by too high. Here I am while I'm editing this video and I thought I should describe this better. It's a too deep hole by too high in the back and one high in the front then with the slab on top. The too high in the back allows the boss to stand up or have enough room. I'm not sure if it requires that or not. But then in the front, I trapped it in by only allowing a half a block of space. Then in the front, I put a half a slab. And you guys gotta see how easy this is. Everybody was having so much trouble with this earlier. Uh, not everybody, but people with no gear, which is me, I've got no gear. So here's what you do. You have this half slab, it's gonna block this guy in here. You spawn him back there, there he is. Okay, now look at this, so easy. He can't get out of there, he can't move. There's nowhere for him to go. You just sit here and spam click him until he's gone. So if you guys ever get a chance to, to uh, get this boss again, I don't know how long he'll be around, or maybe next year, just keep this in mind. This is a super, super easy way to do it. Especially if you have no gear. I mean, if you have amazing gear, it's probably easy, you know, a couple hits no matter what. But for me, as you can see, each hit is only taken away maybe 2%. On the, uh, on the last one that I fought, I actually got a cell wand with unlimited uses. Which normally I would say that's trash, but right now in my situation, that's actually pretty useful. Oh, I got spawners, you guys. What did I get? Seven iron golem spawners. Oh, that's so good. That's so much better than this cell one. But yeah, I've got three more to do. And I'll probably go ahead and speed these fights up or maybe even cut them out. I don't know what I'll do. But uh, then I'll come back and we'll go over what I got from each one. Okay, you guys, and, and uh, it was just that easy. I mean, I know I, I'm probably going to speed that up, and you'll see it in Fast Forward, but it's so easy that way. But yeah, there was a lot of people dying and having to chase the rabbit around, because, I mean, it just jumps all around like crazy if you don't have it trapped in somewhere. So definitely do it this way if you're going to do it. And uh, we got the spawners. We got the unlimited cell wand. We got a void chest, which will be amazing later on once we get a minion or two. This is going to be amazing. Uh, if you don't know what a void chest is, it automatically sells items for you. So uh, you can link your minion to this and it will automatically sell everything. Or we could actually put a tier two hopper or even five tier two hoppers pointed into this and they could all be, you know, sucking up everything from the chunk and selling it automatically. So this is definitely very useful. 
And then we got some blocks, which these are, uh, bah, I mean, trash, really. Might get a few thousand dollars from them, but that's about it. Um, and then uh, this morning, I actually also, uh, I don't know why I didn't think of it before, but I noticed this morning that I hadn't spent my points yet. So this morning, I went to the point shop, and I spent all of my points on villager spawners. And, uh, I've also, dang, this lag, wow. I've also been buying them every chance I get, and I've got the villager spawners up to 27, you guys. And I've been buying, uh, IG spawners, uh, iron golem spawners as well. Now let's go put those seven that I just got onto this. But yeah, we're starting to get some good payouts, you guys. I don't know if you noticed, but our payouts are over 100,000 now every two minutes. So it's definitely starting to get somewhere. Let's put these on and we'll see what these... Oh, we might hit 100 now. Oh, so close. 99. Oh, man, we've got to get another one. we got to find some more. But yeah, I've got this 18 million saved up, too. Um, let's check out the auction house. And I've got a ton of keys. I've got a ton of keys to open up crates. Um, let's see, there's no iron golems. We definitely don't want creepers. Is there anything good on here? There's another tier 3 for 15 million. Um, nothing, nothing too interesting. Whoop, that's where I was. Oh, wait a minute. 110 million, goodness. You know what? If we offered them, we could probably get this, you guys. If we offered them 20 villager spawners, I bet they would take it for this. Should we do that? Should we try to go for that, you guys? Try to. I mean, I know it's not mage, but if we have a, uh, a high rank like sorcerer, we're going to make money even faster. Because we're going to get better kits. We're going to get. Uh, we're going to be able to repair our equipment. Right, so if we get a good pick, we can just type slash fix and fix it. Um, there's a lot of cool perks to it, so we might try that. I mean, that would take us back down to seven villagers, but I mean, we got up to 27 once. We can do it again, right? Especially if we already, I mean, we have so many iron golems and everything, too. So I might do that. Um, and what was, oh yeah, the crates. That's what I came over here for. I have got a ton of crate keys. I've got 29 drop party keys. Oh my goodness. Let's open those. We might get some T3s or who knows what. Let's see what we get. A tier 1. Man. We've got two votes. And that's all. So yeah, we are having no luck with the crates at all. Oh boy, we are having no, no luck with the space in the chest either. But yeah, that's all for now. I just wanted to give a quick update. Um, it's Easter, so I don't want to spend too much time on here. But I definitely wanted to show you guys the Easter Bunny boss battle, the easy way to do it. Okay, guys, so that's it for this episode. I hope you liked the video. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you guys want to see. I hope you had a fantastic Easter. I did. And I can't wait to see you next time. Keep playing. Keep having fun. And we'll see you later. Bye.